Здравейте, здравейте, приятели, добре дошли. Welcome to my channel. If you are new, my name is Sarita, Filipina living in Bulgaria. And as you can see in front of us is the box from Soconi. So I ordered this food, I ordered this product from Soconi from Indian store. So I would like to make a vlog just to share you guys what things I bought from them. This is this is cost 76 leva, which is like 32 euro, something like that. Um, I love I love this store from Varna because they keep updating me if they already have something that I want. They call me every time that they have a promotion. And yeah, I am their regular customer. After they sent it yesterday, they called me again saying, Rita, we already sent your box. I said, that's really good. Thank you so much. Well, that's their job as a business owner, but of course, I still appreciate it. I still appreciate it. So anyway, I don't buy I don't buy too much. Let me see the list. So here in Bulgaria, guys, the one thing that I love in Bulgaria is their parcel. Maybe because Bulgaria is a small country and it's not like unlike the Philippines that we are archipelago, we are we have so many islands. Here if you send if you send something from another town to another town or city to city it's not going to take 24 hours if you send it by afternoon example i send it today tomorrow morning it's already in the place where i have to send it i hope you get what i mean so i paid 69.60 lev da Let me show you guys. The first thing I ordered is banana ketchup. <laughs> this is a favorite of my husband. Every time that I'm ordering food from Indian store, he always tells me, can you order me a banana ketchup? So yeah, he like ketchup that much. So this one costs 3.50 left, which is um, 3.69. 105 pesos in the Philippines estimated the next one is I don't remember what I ordered anyway oh I got two I got I ordered two pala so another UFC next one is Yeah, I ordered this sugarcane vinegar. In the Philippines, we use sugarcane vinegar. Unlike here in Bulgaria, that most of the people use um, apple vinegar. In the Philippines, the apple vinegar is expensive. <laughs> well, I think because we don't have apple in the Philippines, but here they have a lot. So we have this in the Philippines. This is very good. Sukang puti. Uh, vinegar from the sugarcane. So that one cost six lev, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, one hundred eighty pesos in the Philippine peso. The next one uh, the next one is the oyster sauce. So my friend Elena from Sofia, when we went to the Pomore, when we went to Pomore last summer, she cooked me the it's like a uh, patlajan. What is patlajan in? It's an eggplant with some some pork and some soy sauce. But I saw her putting the oyster sauce, so I ordered the soy oyster sauce. I'm going to make that. I tried to make her recipe last time, but it doesn't go through like what she made. So I'm sure that it's going to be close now. <laughs> so this one, this one cost ten lev. This is from Thailand. Um, 600, and, 600 ml oyster sauce. 10 leb. If in peso, 300 peso. I ordered 
Bihon. Oh, I thought it's the big one. Ah, they have two small ones. So I ordered this as a uh, uh, cornstarch noodles. In the Philippines, if it's uh, holiday or celebration or birthday, we always use, we always cook noodles like this. We call this pancit bihon. So I, I got two. So for two, I paid seven. 3.45 I paid 7 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18 21 210 pesos 4 peso The next thing I ordered was Tiny shrimp So this is uh, bagoong alamang. Bagoong alamang. Salted tiny shrimps. Um, we have a lot of um, recipe or food in the Philippines with this. So I decided to just order a new one because I my mine was over. So in the next video, I'll probably show you guys how to make Filipino food using this tiny shrimp. This one costs nine twenty, which is... 270 pesos, 273, something like that, in peso. Bagong alamang. Alright. The next one is, I ordered glutinous rice flour because my husband wanted me to make the um, buchi. Buchi is like the round thing, glutinous rice with the filling inside, and then you have to fry it and put sesame seed on as a topping. So when we went to Sofia, my husband ate, my husband ordered the buchi, and he really, really want me to cook that. So I'm going to share you my recipe for the buchi. So this one cost five lev, which is like three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, hundred and fifty pesos for. 400 grams the next one okay i ordered this because this is making some i watch a lot of tiktok videos from this they said that it's good so i ordered one i ordered two korean noodles i can see the price where where is the where is the what is that? Let me see the receipt noodles. Ah, so this one cost three lev each. Three lev each. So 150 pesos each. So I got two. This is probably super spicy, we will see. The next one is mung beans. So I ordered mung beans, guys. Um, this is like very, very common food in the Philippines. If you are Filipino, this is like, this is soup. We made this. We made this as a soup, like how Bulgarian people cook their leshta. But we put the uh, pork uh, chicharon. It's like a, it's like a pork skin, crispy, something like that. So I have here a chicharon and then next time, if I have uh, enough time guys, I'm going to teach you how to make this as a soup. So this one cost 450 lev, which is like 140 pesos for 500 grams. The next one is... I ordered ma ano um sinigang sa sampalok. This is making a soup like uh, shrimp soup or pork soup. In the Philippines, we have this very famous food called sinigang. Um, this is made of different vegetables and um, your chosen meat like pork. I think sinigang is only pork. Sometimes a lot of people also make uh, sinigang na manok. But I haven't tried to make sinigang na manok. So when it's sinigang for me, it's a pork. So I got two. 
This one costs 250 each, so 5 leba, which is 150 pesos for two. The last one that I ordered, guys, is the sardines. I got only two because I just miss how uh, I just miss it. So I ordered two mega sardines before the sardines, guys, is big, no, and a bit fat. Now it's super small because of, of course, everything is expensive nowadays. Imagine the gas and the what's that? The kerosene, the gas for the car. How do you call that? The diesel, the gas. We were amazed this afternoon because we have to charge our car. Very expensive. Same in the Philippines. I think in the Philippines, from the last uh, one month, it's like 40, 30 pesos already. They already price, super price hike, which is not a good thing. Because once the petrol or any type of uh, diesel prices rise, everything is going to be expensive. So yeah, that's all that I bought from the Socon Indian store, guys. If you want to order them, Filipino product, Indian product, I'm going to put their um, website on the description below of this video. They also have their phone number. Don't worry because people there speak English if you are living in Bulgaria. They have a lot of products also from India if you want to protect your hair or if you want to make like different hair masks. I still have their products from the last time. That's why this is the only thing that I ordered. So, yeah, if you have another question, guy, if you have an additional question about here in Bulgaria, I'm willing to answer if I know the question. And I hope you guys are doing well in this time of the year. I know that the situation is, uh, yeah, uh, still the same as two years ago, but hope hopefully we can manage, of course, uh, protect your mental status. Uh, have a walk if you are that's uh, if you are depressed talk with friends read books um, make yourself busy because if you're doing something depression is something that depression hate if you are busy so guys thank you so much for watching and i hope you enjoyed this video if you have any question as what i've said just put it on the comment section below again this is your friend filipina you're the nova may you have a wonderful day in your neighborhood and god bless your beautiful soul everybody Ciao!